Hey guys, Byron here from Hobby King. New product to show you today. This is the Rotor Star Dual Redundancy Power Regulator for helicopters. Now, this is the first in our Rotor Star lineup. This is a similar line to our Track Star and Aqua Star, but this is the Rotor Star series, which is specific to helicopters. It's our premium end of uh, electronic accessories for uh, helicopter models. So, we're excited to show you about this one. As I mentioned, dual uh, dual redundancy uh, voltage regulator, and uh, the way this is different, what makes this very nice uh, in comparison to a standard regulator, most helicopter uh, uh, voltage regulators are basically just an input from a you know receiver pack and then output directly to the receiver. So all the uh, power, all the current of your servos and uh, any other electronics are ran uh, through the receiver still. What's nice about this is this isolates that power. So uh, it's a bit safer and it keeps from uh, drawing all that current uh, for high power servos through your receiver directly. Now you see you've got two leads here. You've got an input lead from your battery which will handle up to a 2S LiPo, up to 8.4 volts. And what this is here, this is a, a charge lead. Now this is very nice uh, for us flying helicopters because uh, as most of you know, you've got your receiver pack mounted inside the frame and it can be a pain to pull it out all the time to charge it, especially if you, um, you know, uh, need to remove it, uh, take you know, Velcro off or anything like that to get it out of the frame. So with this, you can leave it installed and uh, you can actually just hook this up to your charger and charge directly through the unit uh, to your receiver pack. So neat little accessory there, neat little option. Now, as I mentioned, this isolates the power from your receiver. So you'll see here you've got inputs. You've got one through four input, which will take the signal input from your receiver. And then you've got direct outputs for up to four servos uh, or any other electronic device uh, that goes out directly to your servos. So all the power handling is done through this unit. Now, it's quite powerful. This can handle up to 15 amps current, max current, and that would be rated at 6 volt. Uh, and uh, your actual working current is uh, 10 amps. So quite a powerful regulator. Now it's adjustable, the voltage output. So you've got 5.2, 6 volt, 6.8, and 7.4 volt for uh, you know, if you run running HV servos. And it's selectable right on the unit with the dip switches here. And there's also an alarm switch as well. You've got a, a built-in low voltage alarm that you can turn on or off. And uh, it's a very loud, audible buzzer, so you'll be able to hear it uh, you know, if you uh, do start getting low on your uh, input voltage for your receiver. So very cool, very nicely finished product here. Also comes with a cool accessory here. This is a uh, like a LED strobe which will plug in, and uh, you can use this. This will be triggered by the uh, low voltage alarm on the regulator. So if you do uh, start receiving, uh, you'll get into low voltage with your uh, receiver pack. This will light up a very bright, bright white LED. Optional thing. So there's a, a port on the uh, device that you can plug that into if you uh, choose to use this. And then of course it comes with your uh, your servo leads here as well. These are like the uh, interconnecting leads between your receiver and your voltage regulator. This so comes with everything you need. You just need your own receiver pack to use with it. And very cool product, guys. So check it out. Uh, I've just told you the basics on it here. You'll be able to find the full uh, details, uh, the full specifications in the product listing as usual. So check it out. Be on the new items page very soon. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. Thanks for watching, guys.